Hi everyone, it's James in Japan. It is July 29th, 2022. Boy, is it ever hot. It's a little bit cooler in the shade. Anyway, it hit 34 degrees Celsius. With the humidity, it felt like 40. I hate this weather. It gets really hot from mid-July all the way to the end of August. So if you're coming here to Japan, wait a minute, you can't come to Japan with all the restrictions. Anyway, Japan has been trying to reopen. Unfortunately, uh, Shinzo Abe, the former Japanese prime minister, was killed by a, by a fucking lunatic. Sorry about that, YouTube. Anyway, Shinzo Abe tried to reopen Japan. And even after he left office, he had a lot of influence in the LDP party. And that is the leading party in Japan, the LDP, Liberal Democratic Party. So that is the leading party in Japan. So Shinzo Abe had a lot of influence and uh, things were going well until he was assassinated. And now no one knows what to do. Really, they don't know what to do. I hear in the news that things are getting worse. More and more people are getting sick from COVID-19. Oh, geez, I forgot. Oh, geez, I passed the lottery monument. Oh, well, it's Friday and I'll do it again next time. So the Japanese government has been relaxing restrictions slowly. Currently, individuals aren't allowed to enter Japan, only if they're in a tour group. So if you're in a tour group, you can enter Japan. Also, the Japanese government allowed beaches and outdoor events such as summer festivals, they're called Natsu Matsuri, to reopen, to start up again. The flocks of people are going to the beaches, water parks, and they'll be going to the festivals. And most Japanese festivals start in August. So with the increasing number of people getting sick here in Japan, so is Japan ready to reopen? I don't know. I have a feeling that it won't be ready to reopen until like late autumn. Next week, that's August 4th, I'll be heading out to Thailand and making a stop in Vietnam for three days and two nights. But before I come back to Japan on August 19th, sorry about that, I got interrupted. So for people like me who live in Japan, as long as I have my vaccinations and a negative COVID-19 test, the proper one, the nose test, I should be good. Okay, that's it for this video, guys. Thank you for watching. Look forward to visiting Japan in the near future. Like and subscribe to my channel. Bye.